Cast of Special Forces. It's out. Me and you. It's an elite cast of it Special is. Forces, to say the least. Um, number one guy, Nick Vial. <laughs> number one guy in the group. Number one guy. I cannot believe. I, I, I just said to you that I actually think that Nick did this as a strategic plan. I mean, I don't know if he knew the cast before, but if he did know the cast before or rumors of the cast, that this was a strategic plan to get the inside scoop for his pod. Because Absolutely. nobody, he talked about Scandaval so much, like so many episodes about it. So many people came in to talk about it. Like the man's an expert in Scandaval. I'm like, he's going on the show with Tom Sandoval so he can find out the tea. He's already talking about it. He said that Tom brought a picture or pictures, I don't know, of Rachel and that you weren't allowed to actually bring anything. No keepsakes, no nothing. And that Tom snuck one in and that he was like, you know, Nick was like, I, I would would have loved to have taken something you know, picture of Natalie or something, you know, and I, you aren't allowed to, but Tom did. And that he said that it really seemed like, you know, he cared for her. My mind just went to a dirty place. What? That they, that he brought in the pictures for his special time? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't really know how for his, much. <laughs> for his wank off. <laughs> I don't know. I'll be his honest, I don't know how much. Time. I, as somebody who watched every episode of the first season of Special Forces, not a lot of space to have to wank to, off to have that happening. I think we should use every disgusting word we could think of this podcast. Yeah, wank isn't disgusting. No, no, that no, was just a word that we yeah. wouldn't use. Wank so, like, we would say jerk off, but yeah. like j- Tom's wank off time. Yeah. yeah, I told you. Remember when we were talking about it with Hannah Brown? Like the bathrooms, like are all right next to each other. True, and true. it's just like there's no. It's like open air, and there's no like. Yeah. cover you can basically see over right. the side it would be illegal to, to yeah yeah all right so nick tyler cameron is on des bryant nfl uh wide receiver savannah chrisley black china brian austin green robert horry nba player aaron jackson olympic gold medalist speed st- skater Olympic ski racer, uh, Bodie Miller, Jack Osborne of the Osbournes, Tara Reed, Kelly Rizzo, who's the uh, um she was married to Bob Saget. Mm-hmm. Jojo Siwa. And like we already mentioned, Nikki V. So So I want to say inc- something honestly incredible cast of characters. It is, and, and I want to say something that may be rude. Go right ahead. Where do you have to be in your career to get on this show? Because I think it's one of two things. You're either falling off or you're, you're, you're rising. And there's really no in between. I think that's very fair. I also think you can get, because it is a very unique show that I do think people are interested in seeing how they would do. Mm-hmm. There isn't that many reality shows with this or competition shows with this format that's like this intense that I do think a lot of people are actually like, damn, I'm curious to see how I would do on that. Yeah. And they're like, I'm going to do it. It's you know? just like when you, it just, because it's, 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 a, a, it's certain a certain characters that you throw in where you go. Right. It's a short commitment too. Like I don't really think they film for that long. Yeah. I think you're gone for like a very extensive week ish time and like if I'm, if I'm Nick Vial, I'm like, yeah, I'm obviously going on this show. Right. Gets my name out there more, grow the podcast, right. all these things. Right. If I'm Tara Reed, I'm like, yeah, I'm going on the show because I, you know, I, I have to put my name back out there right. because I'm not really landing as, as many roles as I once did. I mean, why, what's the reason for any celebrity to go on a reality show? You know, they, they, they're either revamping or... You're right. Re, like, you know, like Black China, she's done a whole big transition in her life she's stopped drinking right like she's mm-hmm. like she's living a healthier life so it seems so for someone like this she's like damn like i'm really testing myself and seeing what i can do changes it of course then you have like the athletes the olympic athletes the professional athletes that i'm sure are also very curious just to see how they would do with something yeah. like that with something like this the intensive challenges that they're that they're put into and seeing how it goes. Shout out to the casting team on this, getting that quick Sandoval cast. Yeah. Yep. Big time. 
Because even though he's so hated, people are going to watch what he's in. Right. And especially because this is a show that is so physically taxing that people would be interested to see him fail. Mm-hmm. That sounded a little harsh, but... See him cry and bleed. Yeah, I actually, I really do feel like yeah. people would be like, damn, we want to see him, like, really struggle and challenges. Yeah. But I'm I'm excited. I think I may watch this one. We'll have to we'll have to ask Tyler about it because he just you know he he just pops up in things and mm-hmm. you're like. 